Hello everyone, Ro Sensei here, and welcome to Mega Man Battle Network. Oh, listen to that song. Mmm. So good. Now, to be honest, I actually wanted to start... I honestly wanted to start doing, like, the Mega Man Battle Network series from 3 onward, because I'm not gonna lie, I do not like Battle Network 1 or 2. Especially not the first one, for many reasons. But at least I'll have the ability to use save states for this, so maybe it won't be too bad. Anyway, uh, let's get started. Ooh, what good timing since the music on the menu there just ended. Lan, wake up! If you don't get up, you'll be late for school. Dot, dot, dot. PET Net News, World 3 Crime on the Rise. It says that the World 3 plan to control the net. It says the World 3 plan to control the net might be... St oh, okay. Uh, sleep. You got mail from Dad, too. Look. Sorry I couldn't get off work Sunday. I'll be home soon. Here's a present for, for you. It says... There's some it says there's some battle chip attack battle the something 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 attack. <sighs> oh, I was just having a great dream too. I'll explain the chip data, so check your PET later, okay? Ah, uh, so here we are at the beginning of the Battle Network series with Battle Network One. Ugh. as I said, I do not particularly like the first Battle Network. It's great for what it is. It's the first game in like the ver in like a really great series that I'm hoping gets the next Legacy Collection, that and Star Force. So let's first get this. Lang got his PET. Press Sport Run, Shift Data, and Read Mail. Lang got an AI navigation program, Mega Man .exe. Lang, good morning. Morning, Mega Man. If you need to talk to me, just push the L button. Okay, let's hit the school. Land, check your mail again. We already read that. Oh, God. We already saw that. Dad's saying sorry. And a cross gun chip C. Okay. Hmm. Four panel. Now, before the actual tutorial for it starts, I honestly hate the tutorial for, Bat for the Mega Man Battle Network games. So, I will explain certain things for it right now. Specifically, what chips are. The battle chips are your main source of weaponry. Now, you see these three can these four cannon chips? Because they are all the same kind of chip, I can use them. But say it's like, oh, I got I use a cannon. Uh, I can I cannot use a shotgun or a cross gun, mini boomer, sword, you know, etc. etc. Um, every chip has an element. Uh, these ones are all, like, null element, as in they don't do anything. Uh, eventually, though, eventually in some games, this will, uh, the recovery chips will get a healing element. I think that starts in four. But, um, say if I chose, like, one battle chip that has that A next to it, that's the chip's code. Say if I chose a cannon and it had an A, uh, but then, like, say, this recovery chip, you know, it's not a cannon, so typically I shouldn't be able to use it. But it has the A code, meaning that I will be able to use it. So that's kind of what it is there. Then you got, like, the steel chip, also known as an area grab, that steals enemy panels, you know, and all the other ones are self-explanatory on what they do. The escape chip, which I think is only in Battle Network 1 and 2, is a battle chip that you use to escape from enemies. Honestly, I really hate that. There's Mega Man's custom screen. Um, honestly, I really hate it. How fast is... Okay, that's not too bad. Um, I honestly really hate the f idea of using a battle chip to escape battle. Because my first Battle Network was actually Battle Network 3. Um, I'll gush more about that game when eventually I get to it. But when... 
in Battle Network 3, if I'm correct on the escape chip being in Battle Network 2 as well, in Battle Network 3, you could just, when in battle, hit a button and you could possibly run. If the enemy is too strong, good morning, Lan. Morning, Mom. Breakfast is on the table. You have time to, you have time to eat. Okay. Um, you have a chance to escape battle. But if the enemy is too strong, you'll probably say, like, oh, no, we couldn't run. So, you know, it was like that. If you ask me, I think it would have been better if in this game, and I think the second, if you could still, if you could have done that, but the battle chip, like, guarantees you'll run away, you know? Kind of like with Pokemon, when you have, like, the smoke bomb item. Lan eats a hurried breakfast. Yum. Lan found a chip under the plate. Lan got chip for recovery 10A. Cool. Ah, hello. Lan, you're late. Uh-oh. Meilu looks grumpy. Now you may have realized I called her Meilu. Um, there's no, even though there's no you. It's because in, uh, in Japan, like, her name is supposed to be pronounced male, like, email. But, because, you know, music and internet references. But in the Mega Man NT Warrior anime that I grew up with, you know, they called her Meilu. Because, again, in the Japanese version, her name was, in English, Meilu. So, you know, they literally translated it to Meilu. So that's why I always call her that. I don't like it when people call her male. It just doesn't sound right. No one asked you to wait for me. Hmm? Did you just say something? Come on, let's go. Why do we always have to walk to school together? Silly, because we've always got so much to talk about. She means she's got a lot to talk about. You just listen. Quiet. So, Meilu and Lan are childhood friends, and, uh, you know, I ship them. People's ovens have been spitting fire all, all of a sudden. Hmm. I bet it's another World 3 virus on the loose. You're just imagining things. Maybe. Well, here we are. Let's get to class. Morning, Lan. Dex was looking for you. He's too big to be in elementary school, you know. Scary. Now, something I would like to apologize in this video, since it might be going up, uh, tomorrow, since, as of the time of this recording, um, I want to apologize for my Pokemon Crystal Nuzlocke, how it's been lately with, uh, and how it will be until, I want to say Wednesday, maybe Thursday, I'm not quite sure when the latest episode will be uploaded, but, um, or when I'll record next. But I just want to apologize for all of, like, the rapid and overuse of fast-forwarding and that. So, I, I hope you don't mind. And, you know. So, I'm very sorry. These books are all Miss Mari's favorite. Dr. Yasu's Guide to Virus Busting. Looks interesting. Of course it does, Lance. <laughs> what? The blackboard is covered with nicks and graffiti. Um, sure it is. Alright guys, what kind of, well, I don't know, I'm not good at editing, so I can't really put anything up there that would be like, oh. But, yeah, so here's our, here's our classroom. I'm guessing we have to talk to a lot of people first. This here is Yai Ayana Koji, I believe her name was. You asked moi, Madame Yai herself, about P.E.T.? Sure. Curiosity is a virtue. Okay, listen up good. P.E.T. is short for Personal Terminal. It's a portable link to the net, see? Kind of like a cell phone that doesn't... But, but a whole lot more. You can send mail, use electronic money, and read textbooks. The Navi program inside helps you have a... If you have a problem. You have one in your P.E.T. too. Wasn't it called Mega Man? Yes, it was. Whoa, no way. No way what? And I was like, for real? Oh, boy. Something I'm also going to do is attempt to not have, like, these parts end in a certain way. I'm going to hope. You know, like my Pokemon Crystal does. And you say we're home in Evan Sarge, Speed of Fire. Lan, you hear about the World 3's plan to control the net, yeah? Yeah. I talk about scary. I mean, what are we supposed to do? I talk like that for him because, you know, he doesn't have a nose. He's creepy staring at me. I thought we were supposed to study him, not the other way around. Wait, what? Oh, it's a frog. Huh. Toad Man. 
I've been waiting for you, Lan. I challenge you to a net battle. You're wimpy Mega Man against my guts, man. I heard that. Net battling isn't allowed, you know. Aw, oh, stuff it. You sure got a big mouth for a shrimp. We're not bothering anyone, are we, Lan? Well, I guess. Shrimp? That's no way to talk to a lady. Oh, yeah, so, uh, character introduction. Yeah, that that's Yai. She is a... She's a rich girl. You know, she's like the rich kid who uh, skipped, I think, like two grades. Um, and yeah. And this here is Dex. I forgot his last name. I think it, it like, I don't, for some reason I want to say it had some, it sounded like Dingo or something. I know it's not actually Dingo, but. Oh man, class is starting. Epic class land, be there. Yeah. Let's begin class, shall we? First period is virus busting. Who's ready? Who's read net news? This is Miss Mari, Land's teacher. To be honest, when I was a kid, because of like the way Miss Mari looked, I always thought her hair looked like, you know, those Swiss rolls. I did. It, it said World 3 Net Crimes is on the rise. Very good. And extra marks for checking your net news. Of course, you, you should know too, Lan. It's important that we all know how to fight viruses. Huh, I'd like to see a World 3 virus take on me and Guts Man. Hmm, Dex and his silly little Guts Man. Would you say? Relax, why would the World 3 bother with you anyway, Dex? Why you? Learn! Quiet in the class. Today we'll be using the common virus called Metors. Jack in your PET so your net navy can access the net. Lance, you said to jack in. Press the R button. I did. Yeah, yeah. And jack in. So glad it's not jack on and jack off, am I right? It looks like everyone's navy is online. Okay, I'm releasing the Met Tool. Oh, Met Tool. I thought it was Met Tour. Oh, data now. Everyone ready? So here we are with the virus training i had already explained just about all of this so here's the later thing this is the custom menu where you will choose battle chips that are randomly given to you throughout the fight right now they're just instructing us to use the cannon chips press ok and here's the battlefield up in the upper left corner is my health the bar next to it is the custom gauge when that is full I can uh, get more battle chips. The uh, battlefield is a 6x6 six six grid with the enemy is occupying one side and me occupying the other. Good job. Let's go on to the next lesson. Now I'm going to actually power through this so that I can actually stop at a good point. But here we're talking about uh, support, support chips and how they work with others. Use area steel. Use area steel to grab the enemy's tiles and then use the wide sword to take out two at once. Press the B button and you can use Mega Man's Mega Buster. Okay, let's grab more chips. All right, and now for the final lesson is the add feature, which allows you, once you uh, grab enough chips. Wait, what? Oh, no, that's Battle Network 3's style. Dang it. Well, basically, without selecting any chips, if you right under OK where it says add, if you hit that, you will get a you'll get an extra row of chips that you can use. So, good job. That's all for today's class. After class. Phew. Wow, today just flew by, huh? Let's go home. Okay. All right. So, like I said, I don't want to make it to where it's like, oh, here's the video, and then all of a sudden I'm saying something, and then the next episode, and then the episode ends. So... I'll, I'm going to leave this episode right here, you know, just so you know, and we'll continue next time. See you then.